Over the past few months, I've been binge watching old school RuneScape series. Two YouTubers in particular, Earth and Settled. Both have incredible series ideas that they got from other YouTubers, but have put their own twists and difficulties into the mix. Watching them simultaneously gave me an idea. What if I took both series and combined them, making it a bit more difficult and challenging myself further in the game than I ever have before? So this is Extreme Chunk Hardcore Tile Man. I'll be locked to a specific chunk and I will have to navigate that chunk in Tile Man mode, meaning every 1000 experience I get unlocks a new tile. I'll be starting with two chunks unlocked, and once I complete those two chunks, I will roll for two more random chunks, giving me more tasks to complete. The rules are as follows. To complete a chunk, I must complete the highest skilling challenges, complete quests and diaries, obtain all unique monster drops, obtain all unique items, and complete all minigames within that chunk. I will be starting in the Koran Castle chunks. The rules for the tile man portion of the series are, I must stay within my tiles at all times. I cannot place and then remove a tile even if by accident. And once I finish a chunk, any remaining tiles cannot be used in the new chunk. Meaning I must gain new tiles to use them in the next chunks. So when I get to that point, I'll spend all of the tiles within the completed chunk before moving into the next one. Every 2.5 million experience I receive will raise the experience I need to unlock a tile by 1000. Once I hit 10 million XP, the XP per tile will no longer go up any higher, capping me at 5000 experience per tile. I will be doing this as a hardcore Iron Man, attempting to keep my status the entire time. If you have any questions about the rules, let me know down in the comments, and if you like this type of content, drop a sub. And don't forget to turn on that notification bell so you never miss an episode. Let's get started. Okay, so let's go ahead and come up with a name. Uh, chunk and tile. Chunk and tile. Nice. What is chunk and tile going to look like? Kind of a crop top, big arms, nice pantaloons. All right, here is chunk and tiles. Okay, so I've gone through Tutorial Island with the minimum amount of XP as possible. We are going to be a hardcore Iron Man, and uh, we'll go ahead and get off this island and get started. Okay, we are at the starting location. I'm going to go ahead and unlock this tile. I'll be starting right in front of this gravestone, and these are the two chunks that I unlocked. I have the core and castle unlocked. Well, part of it, the, the backside is not and uh, this area as well. I'm also going to drop all of these items because we did not receive them in the chunk and I just wanted to make sure that you guys get to see that and we're gonna go ahead and hop worlds. Uh, yes, all right, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so let's see what we have to work with. Uh, we have men and women roaming around in this area, which is nice and I believe there's rabbits. Where are the rabbits? Yeah, there's a rabbit here. Uh, which I will be able to fight soon if they come over here. So I'm going to start off by trying to pickpocket these men and women. And then I'm going to, I think I'm going to figure out where these rabbits spawn. Because there's three. Ooh, there's one. Okay. Uh, there's three. There's one right here, one here. And then there's one back here somewhere roaming around. So I'm going to try to see which one spawns closest to me. And then I'm going to direct the tiles in that direction. And then something else that I noticed on the mini map is there's these ranges, cooking range. So I'm going to go ahead and kill these rabbits, collect their dead bodies and go ahead and come in here and cook them for extra XP as well. And yeah, let's go ahead and see if we can't get our first pickpocket. Let's go. Keep going Two. nope. Close. Nice. Okay, so I managed to get 10 pickpockets in so far, so that is <laughs> 80 XP. Uh, so yeah, we're getting there. Two. Three. Four. Five? What? Okay, five. <laughs> oh, man. Damn, okay, so I think I got her stuff. Nope, okay. Well, see you later. 
this guy just does not want to come anywhere near me. <laughs> he just, he keeps going straight around me or walking right past me. And I really don't, I'm trying really hard not to go off the tile. And another thing that I forgot about is that rabbits, I believe when you get them down to like one HP, they run away from you. So I'm only going to be able to get them down to one HP and then they're going to run away and I'm going to have to stay on the tile and that's going to be a pain in the ass. And you guys are probably wondering why I'm not doing the whole talk to thing. And it's literally because it just doesn't work. Um, see, <laughs> it just, it doesn't work at all. So I can't, I can't pickpocket and then talk to them and keep them in dialogue next to me. It just doesn't work on, on men and women. Just come on, just come over here. Just stand right next to me, please. I'll give you a cookie. Oh, here she comes. Here she comes. Okay, well, I see how it is. This rabbit has been taunting me. Oh my goodness, a sandwich lady. Okay, uh, you look hungry. Tell me a chocolate bar. Okay, that works. Nice. We have our first item other than uh, coins. Chocolate bar. No. See, this is the difficult part. The pathing needs to stop near me. And this rabbit over here keeps coming to like this point over here and then turning around and going back. And and this is the first time this guy has gotten that close to me. They're all just staying away. They're avoiding me like the plague. It's like they don't like my crop top belly button or something. Oh, oh, oh. You're joking. Oh, it's going to get so. Oh, my goodness. Okay. One. You're joking. Two, three, four. Okay. Five. Okay. Okay. What do I do here? <gasps> no. Okay. Man, what are you going to do? Do something, please. Come right here. Get stuck here. That way you can't go that way. Come on. Oh, come here. <gasps> this is, this is amazing. This is it right here. This is the, this is exactly what I needed. Let's go. Oh my goodness. Why did you go around? I also don't want to try doing the talk dialogue thing anymore because they do become aggressive. The more that you talk to them, settled proved that in his video. And because I'm a hardcore, I don't really feel like losing my hardcore status to a level two, you know, that would just be, oh. Jesus, come on. Just cut right here. Just stand here. Let's go right now. Right now. Let's go right. Come on. You're just going to stand there. Okay. All right. Bring your pocket right here. What are you doing? What was that? A merry-go-round? What is wrong with you? Just come here. Thank you. Five thieving milestone. First milestone. Now, uh, once we get over to uh, all the way over here, I'll be able to use the... Uh, there's like a tea stall and some other stalls over here. There's a food stall, like a cake. So I'll be able to get over there. So what I've noticed is that this rabbit right here will come up to this square. This rabbit over here only comes out to about this square and then they stop. So I think they can go further, but their pathing doesn't allow them to. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these two squares are going to be my first unlocks. That way I can kill the rabbit when he's right here. And if I can pull him back one square, I'll be able to bury the bones as well as pick up the meat. And then I can start working my way this way to this rabbit spawn. That way I'm not only going backwards and I can work my way into the castle area. I think that is kind of the best route. If any of these people would come anywhere near me, screw you squirrel. You're just taunting me. And uh, yeah, so I think that's the route I'm going to go. I'm still thinking, but I'm almost positive that's what I'm going to do. And with that pickpocket, we are now a little bit over halfway to our first tile. That's exciting. Why am I not pickpocketing? Six thieving. Let's go. By the way, if any of you decide to make an account like this, let me know down in the comments below. Drop your username as well, and I will add you up. And uh, we can go ahead and chat, kind of discuss what 
what route we're gonna take oh come here give me it yep yep don't move Phew. okay we're good uh but yeah let me know uh kind of oh oh no okay yeah let me know oh snap uh okay where are we going oh nice do we get to go fishing yes <laughs> oh sweet okay that fishing xp is gonna help we okay so that should be some fishing xp nice 650 xp that gives me one tile let's go so for those that i uh, may not remember or don't know i can do oh my gosh he's right here okay so for those that don't remember uh i can do any random event so if a, a random event pops up i can do it i don't have to worry about tiles in the random event Okay, so now that we have an available tile, I've been watching these people, okay? I've been watching them for a very long time. That took uh, about two hours to do, a little bit, maybe a little bit over two hours. So I've been watching, and she likes to come over here a lot. Uh, he He's useless. He just sits over there. He likes to come over here a lot. She likes to come right here a lot. So what I'm going to do is unlock this tile because I can go diagonal. She's going to come over here quite often where I'll be able to pit po pickpocket her. And then he's going to come over here. I'm going to be able to pickpocket him and her. And then when we unlock the next tile, I'm going to unlock this one because the rabbit comes right here. So we'll have a couple different options. And she sometimes comes up in here too, so... You never know. I could just camp this spot and see what happens. Okay. Oh my goodness. I thought I almost ran off the... T <gasps> Woo! Ten thieving. Let's go. <gasps> nice. That was clutch. One more. Okay. One more. Okay. Oh my goodness, no way. <laughs> that was so clutch. 72 XP. Oh my god, this was going so much faster. Oh my goodness. There's no way. 8 XP, there's no way. <laughs> Come on. Oh my goodness, I'm so close. Come back over here, please. Right here. Oh my goodness. Nice, we got it. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to unlock this one. The reason it says 1,129 is because I had to make up for uh, the experience that I got on Tutorial Island. Well, uh, we're going to go ahead and unlock this tile now. So we have these three. The rabbit likes to come up to right this tile a lot. So I'm going to try to kick the rabbit. Hopefully it does not run away. Uh, I didn't really think about that, but... Yeah, we got another tile. That's fine. Nice one. Oh, come on. You're... You... That's right. Come here. No, what? Excuse me, madam. You can't just go inside me like that. Come on. Oh. Okay. How long are you going to stay here for? Like, two of you? Okay. Why is my XP not dropping down thank you okay stay oh my goodness that was a good one <gasps> no yes bro don't met don't <laughs> oh my goodness oh <gasps> i got the rabbit oh my goodness okay okay so the thing is okay Wait, I can't have this on. Uh. Yep, see? Because it runs away. Okay, that's fine. Oh, let me pickpocket you. Oh, okay. That works too. So that's cool. I'll be able to get experience from that now. Let's go. 13. Let's go. Keep going. One more. Keep going. Nice. Again. One more. Oh my, okay. You can move now. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. So I kind of made the executive decision to just unlock this tile over here. Ooh, nice. 
Uh, reason being is because I see this guy come up here a lot and I can't get to him when he's over here. So uh, this area would be perfect because this girl over here likes to come over here as well. This girl uh, up here likes to come over here as well. So I think my best bet is just going to be pickpocketing at this time. Just because even if I come here, the rabbit just comes straight up and out here and just is everywhere. At least in this area, I can catch him in a couple different places. See, this is what I'm talking about. And catch him right here as well. Oh, nice. We got another random event. All right, let's go do this. All right, what do we get? Ooh, the camo top. Let's go. First wearable item on the account. Oh, oh. 15 thieving. Let's go. Having this open right here has made this so much easier. Where are you going? No, 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 no. Okay. So I decided to unlock this tile here. I want to start moving this way so that I can fight this rabbit. And then I will be closer to the range, which is just around the corner inside the castle walls. So any movement this direction is, is going to be good, even if it's not necessarily the best for XP. Oh my goodness, I got my first genie while I was saving a clip. Okay. Nice. Uh, what are we using this on? Oh no. Uh, I really don't know what I need to use this on. I'm going to hold on to it for now. Because I don't know what the best skill to, to use it on is yet. Oh my goodness, I killed one. What the heck? nice <laughs> sweet killed uh killed my first rabbit too bad i can't pick the stuff up but uh one rabbit down 22 xp to three strength looking good okay let's go heck yeah okay we got one more tile i think i'm gonna expand this way i'm missing out on pickpocketing you damn i think i'm gonna expand this way because i get this one and then this one and i'll be able to fight this rabbit as well i need seven strength levels to be able to hit it too so uh oh i'm almost dead let's not do that uh so yeah I, i'm gonna go this way let's unlock this tile here so I know that this is going to be cut up quite a bit because there's a lot of periods where there's just really nothing going on. Uh, but I've been at this for seven hours, maybe a little over seven hours. So that can kind of give you guys an idea. Uh, it's about it's close to an hour a tile um, in the very beginning. That's when it took the longest. And now it's kind of evening itself out, which is nice. Nice. Okay, I got another random event. Uh, I don't think I get really anything from this, so this is going to be kind of useless, but we'll do it anyway. Okay, yeah, I got 320 coins. Uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, it doesn't really help me right now, but later on, that'll that'll be useful later on. Oh my god, that was great. Oh, hello. Yes. Thank you. Okay, we have another tile unlocked. Um, I really want an open area here so I can move around a little bit more freely. However, I really want to get to that rabbit because he comes up to right here. Okay, we're doing that. So I'm actually just going to use this lamp on kind of whatever skill is the highest at the moment. The reason being is I need as many tiles as I can possibly get, especially in this beginning portion, because I really don't want to be stuck here forever. And uh, this will just speed it up. So I'm going to waste them now. And then later on, I'll use them for whatever they need to be used for. OK, so we are on day two of uh this i have managed to get three more tiles my attack is four strength is five i've been working on attack because i know that i'm gonna need uh attack when i start killing these guys however i can hit a two now 
which is nice. So we're going to be able to fight these men and women soon. I just, I really don't want to get stuck here with low hit points, especially because I'm a hardcore. It would really suck to die here. So I'm going to wait till I have five attack and then maybe I'll start working on a little bit of defense. And then I should be able to take these, these dudes on easily without, without any issues. But yeah, having these squares open and this whole row right here, has made such a difference it, it's it's a lot easier now and then this rabbit he comes right in this area all the time so i've been able to fight him quite a bit but yeah it, things are going smooth um and we're gonna be oh see see what i'm talking about we're gonna be uh over by this rabbit spawn which i marked over here in no time so the goal of the account right now is to get near this rabbit spawn so i want to get these squares to come over here so i can start killing this rabbit pick up the rabbit meat as well as the bones and uh, bury the bones for xp and then make my way over to this cooking range and start cooking some of the rabbit which will give me food to fight the men which will be great and then eventually i can move to fighting the guards and i can even run away from them if i have to uh, it, that way I, I don't die because I don't want to die on my hardcore yet. Um, and then I'll start making my way up to the castle to where we want to get as close to the uh, food stalls as we possibly can. Because that's going to be a great amount of XP for me. If I can get to this tea stall as well as the baker stall, we'll have unlimited food. I can stop killing the rabbits and then we'll be able to head into the main castle to the bank start banking some things and then we can make our way into the uh, catacombs here and get some tiles going up to maybe the hill giants first and start killing some hill giants to get some some gear and also work on our combat stats that should unlock quite a few tiles as well and then uh, we can start exploring down here and start actually knocking some of this chunk out because there's a lot of things that need to be done. I need to work on wood cutting. I need to work on cooking. Uh, I need to work on literally everything. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be fun. But uh, I, I'm excited because we're we're really not that far away from making it to that cooking range. Once I can start attacking the men and women, XP is going to fly in like nobody's business. Nice. Okay, quiz master. Let's go. Uh, yes, please. I'm so excited. Okay, so a thousand coins or mystery box. What can I get? I think I can get some good things from the mystery box. So I think I'm going to go with that. That's the odd one out. Um, I believe I can actually get a steel plate body, which would be uh, just a quick upgrade in the beginning. But we can also get cabbage, which is food, which I may not be so mad about i mean usually cabbage is like the worst thing that you get uh or like a, a an old shoe but let's see what what wait what you can get clue scrolls from that nice 25 thieving coming in we almost have our fourth tile which is nice i'm not sure what exactly i want to do yet whether i want these tiles to be unlocked up here or if I want to direct them all this way. Um, if I start moving up this direction, I can get this guy as well. I think that I'm going to be able to kill the men and women based on my stats before I even get over to this area to, uh, kill, the, to kill this rabbit. So I think I'm going to start moving up this way and this way. I think, I think that's what I'm going to do. But I'm going to hold on to these tiles until I get the next one. And I'm just going to make sure that that's exactly the route I want to take. <gasps> One more hit. Come on. Did I get it? <gasps> we got our first rabbit. Oh, we got it on the squares. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Um, So we get to bury our first bones. Wow. Yo, we're making giant leaps on this account. Our four tiles. Um, I think. Hmm. I could do one, two, three, four and open up this whole area up here. I think that that might be a good idea. Hold on. Okay, let's do that for sure. Uh. 
We're going to unlock this one. Okay. Hmm. I'm thinking because I'll be able to get him and her as well. Yeah, let's go this way. Sweet. Okay, so I have these unlocked. The rabbit comes up along this line anyway, so I'll be able to attack him now at three different points. And this... Oh, no. Okay, yeah, this is going to help out a lot. See? She's already up here. She's already in my squares. Get in my squares. Oh, she's stuck. <laughs> Look at this XP. Oh my goodness. And she said, yep, it was a good idea to unlock these squares. Nice. So I should be able to get five attack with this. Uh, two more hits. Yep. One more. Oh, <gasps> there we go. Five attack coming in. Can attack him. I just don't want him to run away. Take me off the tile. There we go. Okay. He ran away. Nice. We got five attack, five strength almost ready to start fighting the men and women so there's two items that i can get from these men and women that will really really help me out i uh, don't want to run with this guy and that is the iron dagger as well as the bronze medium helm uh, if i can get those uh, if i can get those knocked out as soon as possible this guy's still fighting me he usually runs away uh, let's see if we can actually get these. Nope. Okay, there he goes. Uh, we can get, uh, yeah, the, the bronze med helm and the iron dagger. Sorry, trying to do like 12 things at once. Hello there. And uh, yeah, those will be decent upgrades in, in the beginning. We definitely need those two unlocks. Okay, so we got another tile. I'm going to unlock this one just so I have more area to, to run around because having to go from this side to this side and having to go around this square was a pain and it would just take a lot longer so this is going to make it easier for me to just get side to side which is uh what i need to happen because i do a lot of kind of running back and forth uh but a lot of stuff has been happening in this area which is why i've been able to knock out the xp so quick so it, I, right now we're at about 25 of course 25 to to 30 minutes about for for a tile unlock which is not too bad uh this one took about 27 minutes for me to to complete so we're getting there nice so i should be able to get three defense here nice yep run away okay cool so that's three defense i'm actually going to give killing one of these guys a shot uh let me wait till my hit points goes back up to 11 Chocolate bar heals three, so I should be okay. I'm going to put it on strength. And I think I'm going to try to attack this guy when he comes over here. Because if I stand on this tile, he will actually become unaggressive and, and walk away. Come on. <gasps> okay, we got him. Um, Try not to miss out. Okay. So far, very good. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, cool. So I think... Oh, you're joking right now. There's actually no way that on the first... No way. <laughs> what? You're kidding. I feel much better now, so I'm just going to see how this goes. This is sketchy because this one I can't get away from. Um, But I'm doing okay. Oh my goodness. All right. That's cool. So we're going to start getting uh, experience from killing the men and women. Sweet. Come on. Is that... Okay, well, there's 10 strength, but wait. Oh, wait, you can now wield things that I can't get. Okay, hold on. Boom! Three prayer. Oh, 10 defense coming in. 10 attack coming in. See if we can get the dagger on this, uh, or maybe we'll die, you know? <laughs> 
Dagger? <gasps> oh my goodness. No way. We just got a Dr. Jekyll. That gives me a strength pot. Let's go. Come on, hurry up. <laughs> Come on. Dang, if only I had a herb. Okay. Strength potion secured. What a nice guy. That's a uh, helmet number five, by the way. One in 64 chance. That's 20 strength coming in. Still no dagger. Uh, I've killed quite a few of these guys. I think I've gotten five or six helmets, which is pretty crazy. Uh, but yeah, still, still grinding. I'm going to switch to attack now, start training some attack. We have 11 tiles available. I'm not sure when I'm going to spend them yet. I'm just kind of uh, liking actually getting XP. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's go. No way. Okay. 14 tiles. We got the dagger. Best in slot for a while. Let's use it. I'm actually training attack right now. Uh, and then watch it not hit. <laughs> this is great. Okay, so this is going to be our best in slot weapon for quite a bit. Super, super excited to have that out of the way. Uh, still thinking about the tiles, though. I'll have an answer shortly. 20 hit points coming in. Okay, so I've decided that I'm just going to go straight towards that cooking range. So let me go ahead and turn on the auto mark tiles and we'll start heading that direction i have to do this right because i really don't want to waste any tiles at the moment so we're gonna go here i don't think yeah okay and one more okay so I believe I have to go in, maybe I can go diagonal, I'll go diagonal here, and then I have to go through there. And we'll be on our way to that cooking range. It's only right here. It's really not that much further away. Um, <clears throat> but this does seem like it's, it's taken quite a while. The rabbit spawns right here. So now I can actually kill it, collect the, the rabbit meat, and... Well, hopefully I can kill it. Yep. Kill it, collect the rabbit meat, and rinse and repeat. Start getting some of these uh, cooking levels up. Nice. Okay, that is 650 XP to fishing. 10 fishing. Nice. Okay. Sweet. So that brought that down quite a bit. Almost at uh, five more tiles. Sweet. 30 strength coming in. Uh, as you guys can see... I've saved up quite a few tiles, so I'm actually going to go use these. Really don't want to use any tiles. I'm going to go diagonal here. 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 Uh, can I go diagonal here? Nope. Okay, that's fine. I don't want to attack any of these guards either. I think I'm going to go here and then go one diagonal because I can't go diagonal here this way uh, I go diagonal here please thank you now hmm I f okay four toss so Definitely not enough to get in there, obviously, but we are very close. We are literally at the front door. Let's go. We're almost in there. There's like what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight tiles left. Eight or nine tiles left. 
We got this in the bag. We're almost to the cooking range. Hey, I hope you guys are enjoying my Chunk Lock Tile Man series. If you are, check out these two videos as well. And don't forget to drop a sub on the channel so you never miss one of these videos.